A father was cited accused of threatening JCPS Superintendent Marty Polio. It happened Monday outside the Van Hoos Education Building. WDRB's Darby Bean breaks down what the citation and man in question have to say about what happened. Darby? Chris Fallon, this man, Brad Lindsay, is a JCPS parent. He says after a phone call to the district, he felt like his concerns weren't being heard and decided to go to the Education Building in person. Like I said, I'm a concerned parent and I'm trying to get my questions answered. That was it. JCPS parent Brad Lindsay cited on charges of terroristic threatening and disorderly conduct. According to a citation, Lindsay started arguing with staff inside the Van Hoos Education Building on Monday about the district's mask mandates and was asked to leave multiple times and refused. He says that's not the case. And at no point was I belligerent with those people. He says he took this video of himself inside the building and claims it supports his statements. The citation reads that Lindsay, quote, aggressively approached Superintendent Dr. Marty Polio outside, yelling things at him like, your life is expletive over. Lindsay says that's not what he said. I said your career is over. I said, your life is over as it pertains to your career. The citation explains that school security my, found my, Lindsay outside in his car and he admitted uh, to having a gun in the car. I carry a firearm regardless and that's that's a separate thing. I have a constitutional right to carry a firearm and I do that anyway. That's not something I did just because I was going down there. The current mask policy that brought Lindsay to Van Hoos is that students and staff who are not fully vaccinated against COVID-19 must wear a mask inside JCPS school buildings. Lindsay says he doesn't want his kids in masks and his main concern is for his 10 year old daughter who he says is on the autism spectrum. She especially is being discriminated against I feel with these mask mandates because she already has a tough time sometimes feeling out when jokes aren't funny anymore and when it's time to stop talking and just things like this that um, really hinder her in her social development. Wednesday, Superintendent Dr. Marty Polio did not comment on the encounter, but says a decision on masks for the upcoming school year won't be made until later this month. We made the mask policy for our summer programming right now because of the CDC guidance. Lindsay is scheduled to be in court later this month. He says he plans on running for school board. Darby Bean, WDRB News.